Well, good morning and welcome back. We're gonna start this morning on Sheer Alley. We got another one up there. But the craziness is, is there was a fan here I didn't see it on the first pass. There's two fans here. I think we'll keep them all in this box so they don't slide all over and fall through. What do you say? Sounds like a plan, Matt. I don't want these car lights. So we got a couple of things in here that we picked up while we were uh, running about like lunatics last night going to baseball and scouts and everything else. Ooh, some juicy wire too. So those are back there. So there's that. And uh, I'm gonna go against I'm gonna go against my thought process and we're gonna go out to the regular hunting grounds which if you watched Kevin's video last night Kevin was out there last night both me and Phil were out there yesterday me and Phil didn't find much though so I'm thinking there's a lot of rule followers out there that aren't putting stuff out till last night or this morning so last week we went uh, off the grid and failed and that's why I think I'm uh, gonna go back out there even though I was considering going to a different area and if we fail we might uh, just break stuff down or we might go out to the area that I was thinking about but I don't know what we'll steps to see how the day goes and hopefully we can fill her up oh by the way if you didn't know that last stop had a fan and we're fans of fans here at nacho stuff so make sure to smash the like and subscribe if you're not already a subscriber hashtag fan of fan morning how are you today Somebody done got the battery out of this already. That's a big old truck. But look at all these Nerf guns again. Oh my gosh. Add to our horde. <laughs> so many Nerf guns. Look at the size of these things. Yeah. Okay, no worries. It's a holster. Big old guns. All right, let's go. Look at this. I think it's a taking apart treadmill. I think it definitely is. Wow. Never seen one like this before. And this will pack much better. We're gonna pack like we find, we're gonna find stuff. We are. Hopefully it's not a waste. Ooh, those aren't one piece. Nice. You actually cut it up with a sawzall. 
or an angle grinder or something. <laughs> Ain't nobody else getting this treadmill. Let's go. Well, I needed a sign that no one else has been out here running. There's a sign. <laughs> there just ain't much out here today, folks. It's cool out today, too. That didn't scare people away. I think that between everybody running around here yesterday and Kev running around again last night, most of the scoops have been scooped. We got here. Oh, don't be wood. Please don't be wood. It looked more and more woody as I got closer to it. Thank you. <laughs> Phew. What is this? It's got any metal content to it? No. Let's do a couple reps. Hey mom, that guy's out there exercising on our machine again. <laughs> oh, got my reps in. Let's go. Look at these fun bar stools. If they were not in rough shape, man, they would be pretty cool and probably sellable. But they are not. They're still fun though. Everything's everything's soggy today, which is no good. The only good thing is, is I have the best subscribers out there who send me gloves, so I can just wear these till they're wet and then change into a fresh pair. Thank you again, guys. You saved my fingers. Well, I just seen the garbage man, and they're just getting out here. And they're all suited up for rain, man. So this, this weather is just uh, not just a little bit of cold. That means it's going to rain if they got their suits on. Because they get briefed every morning before they go out. So I think they're ready for the rain. I'm not. I don't want to be out here in the rain. So hopefully they're wrong. If you got rain gear on now, you're probably going to be hot and sweaty Just do some gutter stompage keep these guys from blowing away Origami. Put you up here. Come on. One more fold? Okay, one more fold of this. Let's go. Well, I talked to Kev. He's out and about. I think this is a pool thing a bobber this is like a monster pool pump but this is for a like a movable one that, that, that guy right there jacuzzi got anything else in here he's out here too he's like yeah i think i think we done got most of it picked up so i'm gonna run a little bit and he's gonna zag to a different area so if i want to go someplace else i gotta zig so we're not all over each other. Let's see what we can find. A little stainless steel sink action. Please don't be plastic. Ah, oh, some nice brass fixtures too. That's nice. Look at this one. Volkswagen bus. Oh, it's the Ninja Turtle van. Oh my gosh. Someone done already got the battery. That is too cool. Wow. I'm using pretty good. 
good shape still too. Mm, I should probably take that, but I'm not going to. Onward! We might be struggling, but we're still getting our tree. <laughs> 25, 26 days in a row. Well, it's not really that many days in a row because we don't run on the weekend, but it's still... We haven't had one. We haven't not had one since the first of the year. On the days we run. How you like them apples? For trees, I should say. Got ourselves a twofer. Can't we get a magical twofer? What's a magical twofer, man? Well, that would be when that dishwasher over there, the stainless steel. What's that? Every day? Uh, you got a yeah, I do. I got a house. I live over at Christmas. Okay. I got a I feel you, man. Yeah, I, I, uh, I live off over a 419, so okay. I can run out there at any time. Just let me know. Okay. All right. I appreciate you. All right. I appreciate you. Have a great day. I think we got a chance here, folks. Lock that door up. Uh-oh, that was, the bracket's broken. Come on, oosh. Stainless, but she's metal. Let's go. Out hunting around in some new areas. Oh, by the way, I got, I don't know if I filmed that dishwasher or not. I think I did, didn't I? Oh yeah, it was a twofer. I thought for a second we didn't do that. This is a water tank from a well. It's kind of like a hot water heater that doesn't heat. Oosh. You're rusted though, dude. Get up there. Let's go. Certainly not thick, but look at the size of this light. Probably has some nice wire in it, right? Take a few screens. Ooh. Not much for weight, but what can you do? Uh, let's put you right here. Uh, no, you'll fall through. I think we're going to do some crushing. some NFJ. I'm sorry, no unload today. We did not find enough to make it deem worthy enough to unload, but we did go to the house and pick up some more non-ferrous. So we'll make Jeffy's stay a little bit chunkier. Where's the boy? Oh, 
how much they are. What's up, Jeffrey? Ha. Wow. Yeah? Sweet. I'll bring my wire tomorrow then. Um, I, I already weighed it, Jeff. That uh, the motor, the mo one motor was uh, just shy of 12 pounds. That's the, big one that you got, the, the big one was 12, it was 1113. Eleven thirteen, and the other one was uh, like five. So this should be twelve, about twenty-one. I'm guessing. Here. <laughs> 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 I told you I've got a certified scale at my house. <laughs> yeah. Come on, you spill like a pound on the ground. <laughs> Yeah, it should just just these four bolts probably, and this pops up to get a, that come out right in the middle, right? Yeah, I got you, but if you can fix it. Ooh! You get the handle. You snap it, so. Oh, really? Just leave the handle. What do you mean? Oh, the the part that makes it go. Shh, shh, shh. All right. Sweet. And I can just hook this up to propane. Tip. Right, but I mean, it just it, it hooks you know, here, one, hooks for propane. One propane, one oxygen. Okay. So cool. That might, that might be worth looking into. Yeah, 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 definitely. No. Yeah, it would. Same thing with the, the, with the extrusion, just melt the side, you know? Right. You know, especially ones that comes straight down. Um, this is going to be dirty brass, right? Here. What? I gave you. That's here. There's a couple of things I want to ask you about. That's there. This is the one you gave me. It's here. Of what? That was 44? Oh, okay. Hey, now. If you brought those in, I would buy that as one whole battery. What what brought what in? Come on, boy. This would be considered one whole battery. Why? Is that a whole bunch of like quarters in there? Uh, that's six volt. That's like off a man lift or a golf cart. Okay. Those but are I'm, huge. I'm, no, but I'm just saying. Remember this ain't coming out. That's, that's going to go as dirty. This, this little one's one quarter yeah. battery. That's this is, this is the other. That was, that'd be nice. that was that one. This yeah. is, this be one? Light iron. Yeah, that's, that's what that, that stuff there is. 
off. I couldn't get that off yet. I didn't have the right size like torque wrench. What's that? No, it's not in yet. Yeah, I know. I saw that. Uh, Sometimes these aren't. That's dirty brass as is. Alright, do it as is. Do it just like that then. Oh, uh, the dirty? Yeah. Yeah. That whole bucket should be dirty. Not much there, but... I, I don't know if you saw the guy out there in the little small black uh, SUV like thing, the Avalanche. Uh-huh. He said he went out to the that type of crap and found a big AC. Really? In the back. I was like... <laughs> I was there this morning. I was out there this morning and there was nothing out there. And, uh, I mean, both both me and Phil were out there yesterday, and Kev filmed last night. Yeah. He found a refrigerator. <laughs> so, I mean, stuff can go out at any given time, you know? Yeah. Is that all the... No, uh, I think so. Done. This is all extrusion. That's stainless. Oh, I wanted to ask you about that. So I started to clean this up and I can't get this part off. What do I need to do to get this? Cause this is, brass, yeah. this is brass, yeah. this is aluminum. Yeah. I pulled all the bolts off, except for these ones here. Those don't go, those don't hold it together to do they though. Do I have what? Yeah, My tools? Yeah. What do you need? fancy stuff dude yep. no I need to get one Thank you, sir.
What was holding it together? Just old. Oh, sorry. That's nice. Uh, can I take that home? It's not aluminum? Yeah, but do you want to get this brass off? Okay. I don't know if you want to. It's one. You ready for clean? This is a garage storage system. That's, all that. That's it on sheet, yeah. Motors. Oh, hang on, Jeff. Huh? This too. Oh. All right, you ready for motors now? That one's got a screw in it, yeah. Yeah, two piece had screws in them. Yeah. It's aluminum. Stainless. Stainless? I guess. Oh, did you take the... That's the only thing on there. Doesn't matter to me. Where, the far one? Oh. That's it, Jeffrey. Let me get my let me get my sheet. We'll do our our joke because I got a good one today. Alrighty, guys, we're weighed and paid. And man, after seeing this receipt, I might bring back non Ferris Friday. I don't know. Crazy. We didn't have a very exciting day out there on the road. It was uh, pretty sparsy, sparsy. But um, I did. I'm not surprised, I guess, because we were out there yesterday. Uh, Kev was out there last night. Uh, it's just been everybody overworked, the, overfished the area. So, uh, anywho, let's jump into the receipt. We ran out in about 10, 740 pounds. So we're a little shy of our uh, thousand uh, pound goal, but not as far off as I would have thought we were. But the, that, uh, when I was unloading that, uh, what's it called? The um, treadmill that was chopped up that was heavy uh, you don't realize it because it was all separate pieces it had some nice weight to it so uh, six cents a pound 44.40 um, and then everything else is uh, Jeffy 
So we turned in uh, number two copper. We turned in uh, the copper from the motors we broke down. That one motor that I brought, for, I bought for uh, five dollars. I got uh, almost twelve pounds of copper out of it, and the other one was four dollars, and I got about. Uh, six pounds of copper so the second motor was definitely a better deal but it also had the housing already taken off of it um, which is very rare so it definitely had a, a better uh, return on an investment we'll, we'll call it uh, but anyhow we had uh, tidbits from copper we've just been collecting in a bucket I wanted to give Jeff that uh, magnet I'd been promising him so we ended up with 44 pounds of number two copper 240 a pound $105.60, and that's right there why we want to bring back Non-Ferris Friday, seeing nice chunky numbers like that. Brass unclean with some stuff that I really didn't feel like cleaning up, so I gave it to Jeff. 15 pounds, 70 cents a pound for 10.50. Um, we had some irony light, which were the screens and some other dirty aluminum, 10 pounds, 25 cents a pound for 2.50. Yellow brass clean was uh, uh, some plates to something he gave me uh, to break down 10 pounds dollar 20 a pound 12 bucks clean aluminum was the gutters uh, the frames for that garage system that I got forever ago but I needed to remove the steel chains and stuff from it I finally did that um, anyhow 46 pounds 36 cents a pound for 1656 extrusion was some stuff that I cleaned up at the house before he got here uh, 46 pounds, 60 cents a pound for 27.60. Electric motors was from the microwave, um, a ceiling fan, and I think there was one more in there. Uh, 13 pounds, 15 cents a pound for a buck 95. Stainless steel clean. Thank you, Jeff. There was a little uh, collar on there that I didn't feel like trying to struggle off, so I said I'll take dirty, but it gave me clean anyways. Uh, 14 pounds, 38 cents a pound for 5.32. or five thirty-two. So um, that was the sink and uh, a pole. Um, so our grand total today was 226.43. What? Bad day? Heck <laughs> no. Just go grab some non-ferrous and make it chunky. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I, I didn't uh, go crazy on the road, but it was nice to break some stuff down. It was nice to get some of the stuff clean out of the backyard. Sorry we didn't unload it. There just wasn't much in there. I mean, you saw what I picked up today. It was pretty dismal. Um, and we tried some new areas, and we tried this, we tried that. It's just Thursdays have been a bust. This is two second week in a row we've busted on Thursday. So uh, who knows? Let's see what tomorrow brings. Tomorrow we've struggled with, but uh, maybe it'll be Chunky Friday with a non-ferrous flare. I don't know, we'll, we'll have to see how tomorrow work, works out. So, uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If you do, make sure to smash that thumbs up. Please consider subscribing if you're not already a subscriber. And it's not show stuff, but that would mean you can't take someone else's trash and turn it into cash. So until tomorrow, be safe, be happy, and I'll see you guys then.